What's up guys, welcome back to the channel. Today we have another awesome bike review. But before we get into it, make sure you like, subscribe, and turn on those post notifications. we have is the Specialized Series X Carbon Comp Fitness Trainer. So come over with me and I'll show you the bike. This is the Specialized Series X Carbon Comp Fitness Bike. This bike is a gravel bike, which means it can go on trails or road or beach. So let's get into this awesome bike review. Let me tell you about the Series X Carbon. This bike is awesome because it's only 20 pounds fully rigged. That's practically nothing for a bike. Let me show you. It doesn't weigh anything. So when it doesn't, when it's not very heavy, it's very fast, quick, agile, and it ha handles the turns very good without losing speed. Let me tell you about the frame. This bike is the Fact Carbon Niner Comp. This bike is a purple tint, gold accent, and integrated black reflectivity. This bike looks black, but it really isn't because there's no paint on it. In the sun, you can see that this bike looks purple because it is a purple tint. This bike's geometry is made for fitness training. And my dad's had this bike for about nine months now. And it has over a thousand miles on it, which is crazy. And it's still holding up to what he likes. So this bike, he said, feels amazing even when it gets older. And even if it has a lot of miles on it. Let me tell you about some of the special features that make this bike awesome. This neck is the Specialized neck. Specialized teamed up with McLaren to make this future shock. This shock is incredible for biking advancements. This shock helps you with, takes the sting out of roots, cracks in the sidewalks, grates, and little tiny jumps. This has 20 millimeters of travel and there's three sets of springs that you can put into it which helps you like putting air into an air compressed shock. It makes it harder to push down or easier to go down. Let me show you what I mean. how good this future shock is until you have it. It really makes riding enjoyable. Now let's talk about the drivetrain. This drivetrain is a 42 tooth 1 by 11 which means there's one chain ring in the front and 11 gears in the back. The smallest chain ring is an 11 tooth chain ring and the biggest chain ring is 42 tooth. The smaller gears are meant for picking up speed to get going faster. This first gear is to help you make more challenging climbs. This derailleur is the SRAM NX. This derailleur can change the gears very precisely and immediately. This derailleur helps it so you don't skip gears or stay in between a gear. These 
These levers are the levers to change gears. This back lever is to make the gears go higher and harder to pedal. This lever makes it to go up for climbing. The brakes that come with this bike are the Shimano MT201 brakes. Disc brakes. They are hydraulic discs and the discs are 160 millimeters. The bike comes with 700 by 38 C tires and they are the Tracker Pro Grip Ton tires. And for a thousand miles, this bike has plenty of tread left on it. So that means the tires wear not so quickly as regular tires probably would. These tires are good for riding on sand, clay, and mud, and also dirt and road. And finally, we have the specialized body geometry canopy saddle. This saddle is very comfortable for long rides. And as you can see here, it's a hollow chromo, chromo seat supports that help the seat stay in place. And something that we forgot to mention, one thing we would change on this bike would be these specialized body geometry grips. We would switch them out because as you can see, they're fat in the middle and on long rides, it tends to make your hands fall asleep during the ride. And also, if your hands are very sweaty, these grips will get very slippery. So it, they're not very good for riding in hot weather where you sweat a lot. So that's the end of this bike review. And this bike is incredible for only $1,600. So if you can, go head up to your bike store and try and find you this bike or the newer models. So if you like this bike review, make sure you give it a like, subscribe, and turn on those post, post notifications. Make sure you subscribe for more awesome bike reviews. And we'll see you next time. Bye.